Dumbarton Foot, Chapter 1.1, Question 5. Proof for all n that the set of residue classes modulo n is not a group under multiplication. So we just need to check using the definition of a group. So remember, a group has a binary operation that must be associative, closed, so it's closure, associativity, it must have identity, and all elements must have inverse with respect to the binary operation. In this case, the binary operation we're talking about is multiplication of residue classes. Now, in question four of this chapter, we proved that multiplication of residue classes is associative. So the first one is satisfied. And of course, it's closed, right? Because congruence classes, congruence class of uh, A times congruence class of uh, B is congruence class of AB. So yes, it is closed. What about the identity? Well, we have that as well because congruence class of 1 times any other congruence class is the same thing as congruence class of 1 times that A, which is the same thing as the congruence class of A. But the real catch is inverse. Okay, do we have that? No, actually we don't. Because look at the congruence class of 0. Is there any congruence class that we can multiply by the congruence class of 0 to give us the identity? There is no such class. There is no such x or x bar in this case. So 0, the congruence class of 0, is in the set of residue classes modulo n for all n. And under multiplication, it has no inverse. So this proves that for all n greater than 1, the set of residue classes is not a group under multiplication.